really exciting because to meet someone that is like my idol means a lot. So coming out here today just is my everything. This boisterous crowd, several hundred strong, is getting pumped and excited and practicing their cheers. They are welcoming hometown hero, skier Kelsey Sirwa, back from Russia. It's so awesome that she's finally achieved what she's been striving for for so long. And it was so exciting to watch that race. I remember we were talking about it at school after as well, and it was just so exciting to be able to say that Kelsey finally, she, she got it, because we've been skiing at Big White forever. Yeah, this was above and beyond anything that I've ever expected. I think it just goes to show how strong of a community Kelowna is, and it's, I didn't get here on my own. It was a huge group effort, and just the love and support that I felt in Russia from Kelowna is it's unspeakable. Surwa watched the men's race the day before her own race and saw the disappointment in Brady Lehman when he finished fourth. And after missing the podium in Vancouver, she didn't want to have that same feeling. Every race I go out, I, I fight tooth and nail to get on the top of the podium. And um, with Marielle in front, we were working really well together. And But it was the most amazing feeling coming over the finish jump and knowing that we were one and two. And we're bringing the gold medal back to Canada and one more. After two blown knees and a broken back, the 24-year-old is relieved to be relatively healthy. I'm glad to be ending this season without crutches in my hands, so <laughs> that's a first time for me in a couple years, so yeah, it feels good. The reigning International Ski Federation and X Games champ hasn't ruled out the next Olympics in South Korea, but says that's a long ways away. For now, she's done with racing this season. South Kelowna Elementary, her former school, adopted her as their own before the 2010 Olympics, and many students came out on this day to meet her and get her autograph. She comes to our school at least twice a year to talk to the kids about motivation, hard work, believe in yourself, and a healthy living. We've been tweeting her, we sent postcards to her of encouragement, which she put up in her room at, in Sochi. I think that it's really cool for her to come to our school. She's such a great athlete to come home with a silver medal. And I also wanted her autograph, and today I get it. <laughs> It's really kind of cool that our athlete comes home with a silver medal and that we're, we're all here today. She has provided an inspiration to current students that they too can follow their ambitions. And I can't think of a better representative than Kelsey Sirwa to show our school and our city and everyone in the world how fabulous hard work and being a great person can be. I think my friend Jared Picklick might make it to the NHL. He's a goalie.